Okay, so we're told in this problem that campsite A and campsite B are located directly opposite each other on the shores of Lake Omega. So here's A, here's B, and they're directly opposite each other. Okay, what else are we told? Um, the two campsites form a right triangle with Sam's position, S. So that means S represents where Sam is. The distance from campsite B to Sam's position is 1,300 yards. They label that for us right here, this distance. And then campsite A, uh, so the distance from A to S is 1,700 yards. They label that as well. What is the distance from campsite A to B? Okay, well, this is a right triangle. They give us this leg for 1,300 and this leg for the hypotenuse. Here they're asking for another leg. So what I would do is I'd just set this up and I'd say, oh, okay, well, I know that A squared, one leg squared plus the other squared equals the hypotenuse squared. And I also know that this, this long side over here, the side that's kind of opposite the 90 degree angle, is the hypotenuse. So that means they're, they're just missing a leg. So we have A squared plus 1300 squared equals 1700 squared. And then what? Well, that means a squared equals 1,700 squared minus 1,300 squared. And then, of course, a would be equal to the square root of 1,700 squared minus 1,300 squared. And this is fairly easy to enter in the graphing calculator. What I would do is put my parentheses in, and I would say, okay, 1,700 squared, press the square button, plus, oh, go back there, sorry, minus 1300 squared, close my parentheses, and that's all to the, in a square root, so I can raise it to the half power. Same thing as a square root. And our answer is 1095.445, and here they want us to now round to the nearest full yard. So, because it's 1095.4, that 4 um, is below 5. So we round it down to 1,095, our answer. Alright, thanks.